Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Ragnarok here with part number six of our Wales Medieval Kingdom 1212 AD mod for Total War Attila. We, uh, last time I really, um, yeah, I really did not do a good job last time. Um, we tried to, uh, tried to siege this out. So far I'm 0 for 2. We tried an ambush here in the woods. And uh, we were defeated uh, because, mostly because of um, uh, morale problems due to the fact that we were fighting. We were Our army was on crusade and we were fighting against a crusader or another Christian army. So we had a big morale debuff that really cost us. And then during the siege, um, I was not able to effectively use the crossbows. And um, we, uh, we were defeated in the siege, unfortunately. So... Uh, we've had to rebuild the Ready force for um, between these two, 12 and 12 is 24. That's just about all we can really recruit. Um, you have access to some swords here. I might uh, I might pick those up because we're kind of short on... on uh, kind of short on infantry. We've only got three spears Ready and then... Another couple spears there, and a couple swords. Uh, we've got some um, basically. Oh, we've basically got eight. Um, Commander. Eight archers. Sorry. All right, let's uh, let's park you outside the fortress. We don't want to battle them in the winter. I think next turn we'll pick up the mercenary. We we'll just go with as much force as possible. Oh shoot. What, uh, why, why is, uh, what does this guy got that's, um, producing more income? Why did that cost us income? I don't know, that's, uh... I'm not sure why leaving this province ended up, uh, costing us income, because now we were plus 300. Ready now we're in the negative. Alright. Ready for orders. Yeah, the question is, on. should we pick up the mercenary? I think we... Well, should we try and ambush them again? At your command. Um, because they do have some of our artillery pieces. I was wondering if there's anything else I can do here. Uh, public order is not terrible. Well, we got the three settlements to, ma to manage for the time being. Take a look at the diplomacy, see if we can get... Uh, if we got anything here that's... Portugal's up for trade. And the good wishes of our people to you and yours. Likelihood low, that's not good. Kingdom of Castile, you guys up for trade. Welcome. Low, on aggression. Welcome Moderate. Still no. Holy Roman Empire. Salutations and the good wishes on aggression, of our... no. Yeah, unfortunately we... In the name uh, of the state, welcome. Everybody... Nobody seems to like us. All right, I don't think there's anything else to do here. Um, let's actually take a look at this. Uh, our generals. Who is our? Who are our, our generals? This guy. This guy. And our king is governor of. Um, well, he's gotten married. What's her trait? Personal influence plus three per term. Wow, ambitious. That's pretty good. Loyalty minus one husband. That doesn't really, it shouldn't really affect him because he's king. That's uh, that's pretty good. She she should rack up quite a bit of uh, quite a bit of influence, and we need him to start having some kids because our uh, family tree is looking fairly barren here. Like, all right, I think I'm gonna end the turn before I overthink it. Yeah. How are we, man? Good. Hmm. Just thinking how we're going to approach this. We can either siege it out, do a double siege, or we can try and lure them out with another ambush. Um, get them in a position to uh, to ambush them again.
Well, we'll reorganize the armies first of all. Who's the, they're both, this guy's the, the two-star general, so we'll, um, oh, actually, don't, don't transfer them while they're in, in that stance. Ready we'll, for battle. we'll lose all our uh, movement that Advance. way. Um, we want them, Ready this guy, battle. this guy's Wales First Legion, we want them in Wales First Make Legion. So, drop those down. Those for sure. Um... <laughs> I'm just thinking. Just thinking. I'd like to have cavalry. All right, let's do it like that. Ready for orders. We hunger for battle. Let's do it like that. So it's actually Ready 23 units. We're still in the negative, but not by much. Come I wouldn't mind getting those. Uh... All right, what's the ambush success chance here? We got 80% chance of ambush. Move to there. I, I probably be better to stay. Ready for further orders. Conceal. In our own territory so that we get replenishment during the end turn. At your command. Ambush will be tough though, still. Ready Not a very orders. two poor got five guys there. Ready for battle. Um hmm. move to there. On the move. Your next command. And go into raiding Raid stance. In. Yeah, it would be better to get replenishment. Like, if they do make the attack, um, it would be better to be standing in our own territory so that after the fight, we get replenishment. However, um, if they don't attack us, um, then we might have to march through here in the snow to make the attack. Though, we would want the least amount of distance. Though probably what I'll do is we'll probably just encamp if that's this if that's the case if they don't make the attack. Um, I'd rather not attack in the winter. What just goes with it, there's only really two seasons: summer and winter. And um, hunger for battle. At your command. Yeah. Ready for orders. All right. 107. That guy's only got 43. Yeah. All right. We're looking good. I'd like to get this guy. Um, how much? Got 39 influence. We'd like to get this guy back into um, into office as soon as possible. But yeah, we've. Oh man, they have <laughs> really the Irish. The Irish <laughs> who are hunkered in to the. Uh, Scottish Highlands have been a real thorn in my side. We've um, I've had a real hard time finishing them off. Um, I think um, I think England will be a little bit easier because their armies they've got more more cities, so it'll be easier to hit their cities um, without having you know an army sitting inside of it. All right, here's their turn coming up. Oh, ambush success! Oh my god, look at the auto-resolve. Look at that auto-resolve. A lot of pikes. I really, really, really should auto-resolve this. They don't have, uh, they don't have very much range. We've got tons of range. The question is, can our front line hold against their, against theirs? Really should, um, auto-resolve this because that, that's giving us a better, better result. But, I don't know. Fans of the channel, you know, we always uh, fight our battles, and then, then I'll gripe about it afterwards, as per usual. Um, because I think the 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 fact that we have ambushed them um, increases our chances for um, for the victory as well.
But yeah, this could be tough. Those pikes. Gotta be careful of them with our cav, but I'm trying to get our cav to take out their uh their artillery and their own cav. Ooh, I like this better than the last one. The last Where's their artillery pieces? Alright, beautiful. Beautiful. Where do we want to Whereabouts are our reinforcements coming in from? Coming in from there. Alright, the reinforcements are really going to be a non-factor. Good setup on this hill, but I kind of like this... This slope over here a little bit better. Well, that's not quite in range of them. Wish we had the trebuchets. Yeah, I don't know. I'm a little bit... Part of me wants to, um, wants to engage with them right away. You stay back here. We don't want to risk you dying. We don't want another general dying. But uh, right here, get into this mess. We can finish off guys quickly. All right, put you guys standard shot. Regular shot. That's good. Four. That's good. Five. Yeah, I don't know. How is this uh, all going to work out? Be able to smash them pretty quick. Look at those. Reinforcing troops, and not a moment too soon. Are reinforcements already, eh? All right, you guys move up here. All right, things are going good so far. We can take out some of these. That their general. The general's coming down here. Don't worry about the artillery. All right, good. They're... We can surround the general. Let's need to get these guys into bear wall. Guys, in shield wall. Uh, this situation is. Oh, Guess keep moving. Yeah, shit. Ah, uh, shit. Weren't strong enough to. Ah, uh, did I? Oh my gosh, my groups. I locked them all. God damn. Their their general smash us there. Ah, uh, for fuck's sake, I can't deal with this right now. All right, you guys back up. Unfortunately, our cab really got off to a good start there, um, but we just got a little bit overwhelmed. Um, let's finish them off. How are we doing here? War cry there. There. 
Who's running? Oh, we might be able to get those archers. That's a little bit, a little bit dicey. All right, this is our. All right, let's come down here and take out some. Um, take out that, that artillery, and you guys see if you can get those archers. Shit! I should have moved it. Damn it, they just blobbed in the middle there. Get you over here. Shit, that's what I was worried about back then. Oh man, what are you guys doing? Why are you moving so slow? I think, we, I think we're in pretty good shape. Sort of. <laughs> sort of, but not really. Our, our cav has really taken a uh, beating. I don't want to get you involved in the fight. You get over here. Um, reinforcing the center here. We, we turn the back. We've got the general here for support. And I think our archers are doing the job. They're damn... Their damn general is really giving us a hard time. Doing a lot of damage. Uh, you guys got ammo left? Can you, can you target him? Ooh, yeah. The question is, are we gonna have an? Are we gonna be strong enough to take the garrison? I think we will be because our our archers are in pretty good shape. Here, throw that down. Yeah, I don't want to throw my general. And the last time we uh, got a general involved in the fight, actually, you know what you could do is run some of them down. But I'm, I'm not going to worry about that too much. God damn, their general is just smashing everything he gets into. Our, it, it's been a bloody battle. There's no doubt about that. Um, I mean, the troops can be replaced. God damn. Ah, oh, shit. Send the spears in. Get the general out of there. Don't want him going down. You could go. We'll, we'll send him to go deal with that. Yeah, wow. Took a lot of damage. A lot of damage. But uh, our archers. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Is it? It, it must be this guy. Yeah, tough fight. Tough fight. The enemy general is God's enemy. Be good. We are moments away from victory. We can run them down. And their army's pretty pretty well wiped out. Um I don't I think there'll probably be a couple of um surviving units though. God damn, we our army took a real real beating as well. But um the main siege attacker the archers are still in good shape and if we lost a unit completely we might be able to we might have picked up um, some of the artillery it's a possibility uh, that is if um, some of our units got wiped out 
I don't think he's gonna. They're not gonna catch them. Close victory. It seems. It feels a little bit more peric peric victory than close. But yeah, 270, 188, 136. Like, look at the job that the archers do. They just, they're, they're so good. So, so good. But uh, man, our cavalry got, got wiped. Thousand casualties. I mean, the casualties are actually not that bad. Two and a half to one. Basically. The army is defeated. It looks like we, looks like they are wiped out. How much uh, units replenish? 5%. Or we could um, ransom and release. It lowers our integrity, though. Does increase some um, papal favor. But I think in this instance, I'm going to go with the replenishment. So their army's wiped out. That's beautiful. But yeah, see what I mean? Like, if we were standing in our own territory, it would be. Um, I think this guy is our, uh, this guy is our, um, he, he's supposed to be a governor. At least that, the general that died was only, only level one. We hunger for battle. If we move to attack the settlement now. You may as well get comfy, men. Are they recruiting? Can we, I don't know if they're recruiting or not. We move to attack the settlement now. We're going to take attrition through here. That's your command. I think we're going to go for it. Ready for battle, commander. Let's uh, let's merge you, commander. Make haste, men. Uh, transfer this guy up. Guy up and that guy down. Oh wait, might as well transfer them all up. March. Never mind. We hunger Never mind. Battle. Don't mind me, guys. Let them I'm gonna make the attack. Yeah, see, we took a little bit of attrition there. Even odds. Even odds, apparently. Um, still got a lot of archers there. Besieging settlement. We hunger for um, we might as well come up to support. Would that I were as swift as the angels. What? We take this settlement. Yeah, the key is shutting yeah. down their archers. So absorb the enemy archer fire with what's left of our spears, and shut everything else down with our own archers. Yeah, this <laughs> this doesn't look good. If it comes to a melee, we don't have a whole lot to uh, duke it out with them. But I I have faith. I have faith in it. eight archers. That's a lot of firepower. Do quite a bit of damage. So I think we should be all right. Uh, the reinforcements though. I'm attacking the fog. No. Alright, looks like we're attacking in the snow. Which is going to slow things down a little bit, but it not affect us too much. Down to down to two artillery pieces, unfortunately. I think we'll take that out and try and take that one out. Take those out. Cav. You guys stand back here with the general. comes to a fight, I think these guys are going to be our most effective. Fuck it. We need these guys... ...guys to block. The R2. 
archers here. Yeah, it's all about the archers. How just how much damage can we get done with our their archers? Is on fire at will. On a little bit closer. Ah, oh, shit. Moved up too close. Damn it. Let's take it down as close. Oh my god. They fucking got one already. Reinforcing troops. And not a moment too soon. Gotta be shitting me. Moved up a little bit too close. Where's our reinforcing troops? Yeah, if we try and turn them around, by the time they get turned around, I think it's just better just to uh, keep focusing, focusing it down. Unfortunately. Come on, hit that fucking thing. Could put a spear out. Maybe I should put these guys out front. Shoot at that instead. It's really unfortunate there. The range of the archers. Oh my god, they're having a hell of a time. Hell of a time there. Now the sieges have been tough. These little settlements with these thin towers, and not to mention we don't have we don't have trebuchets. Trebuchets make the world of difference. I think before we take on England, that I might try and uh, try and save up for trebuchets. Though at the same time, like we don't have we don't have the money to upgrade uh, upgrade that settlement. We're, but I don't know. We're, we're definitely going to need. A stronger, more capable army than what we've got right now. Even with those uh, Crusader Knights, though, but I thought we'd dominate the cavalry situation, but not so much. Right, just one more shot, one more hit. Take it down. Beauty. Beauty, beauty, beauty. Alright, I think... Um... What's the range of those archers? Move you guys over to here. We get range of, uh... That tower, but we don't want to get in range of their, uh... Their archers on the walls. One, two, three, four, five. So they got all five of their archers stacked up against us here. Try and take those towers out first. Be better to take them on. The angle there, but it's yeah. I don't know. It's gonna be tricky. We take them head on, and all eight of our archers dump our, our firepower on there, and should thin them out pretty quick. But the problem is this: uh, they're hidden behind this wall, right? It's hard to. Uh, Yeah, we, we don't have, we, we took a lot of damage in that last fight. We don't have front line guys that we normally have in a siege situation. The odds were pretty much even. 
got a smaller force in here. Question is, can our archers get the job done? I can take out these towers. I can take the shield wall. I don't think he needs the shield wall here. Come on, boys, hurry up. Should create a breach as well. Technically speaking, why do they have uh, this gatehouse? Is open? That's interesting. Maybe we don't need to create a breach. All right, you guys got enough ammo for this, or enough range for that? Should be able to hit it from here. Come on. I don't know why they weren't shooting at first. Should be in range. Oh my god. Only one of them hit those that if that volley had hit it would have went down right away. That would have been amazing. That would have been freaking amazing. How are we doing here? We haven't, uh... The towers don't seem to do too much damage to the infantry troops. But, I mean, over time... It'll... It'll wear a unit down quite a bit. Another hit. Another hit. There we go. We got up to 48. A little bit nervous, um, just because of the last time we were here, and the siege did not go according to plan. So long as we deal out more damage to them than what we take, I will be, uh, I'll be happy. Zero. Six. Ah, oh, come on. Come on. Good, they're moving their archers away from the wall there. That's good. Beauty. Spread you guys out and we'll hit the next tower. Yeah, I'd rather get these towers down than necessarily create a breach. I mean, hopefully we can trigger the army loss with our archers here. Get these guys into position. Shit. Shit. Alright, we gotta we gotta move you guys up. Gotta take out that archer. Wonder if the modders made any um, any changes to the AI at all. That was a pretty pretty smart move by them. They just basically switched those two units. Took one.
take out those archers. Fucking hell. Shoot in our archers. God damn it, this guy is. Pick this guy up. Alright, this is going terribly so far. We've not killed one of them. Why are they not targeting him, man? They're targeting our guys in behind here. Look at the damage this guy has done. Why are you guys targeting over there, not targeting there? That one archer has done a lot of damage. <laughs> Need you guys to get... ...to... ...to just shoot over there. I, we, we have not killed one of them. They're not... Got a few of them. Ready for I need you guys to get into position there. Deadly missiles ready. Just not able to get them on the walls there. Just not, uh, just not able to get them. Now they're moving out. This, oh my God, that arm, that unit, our bit, our our strongest unit just got uh, completely wiped out. having a really hard time hitting them. They're stuck on the walls. It's so hard to hit them. Bring in another guy over. Down to 65. You guys see if you can hit them. Let's move over a little bit. Alright, we've almost got one unit, but the damage, I i think the damage is too much. Get the tower down, we got the tower down. Uh, target in there. See if we can target this guy. might come back. How many just uh there's only a handful of them left. God damn. Come on, shoot. Shoot at them. I would say it's going pretty terribly so far. Um We've got a unit of swords back here that we can use to block. They seem to be, um, intent to shoot at us. Just stand here like that. Where are you guys going? Ah, oh, god damn it. Shoot on an angle like that. Let's push you guys in here. Shoot at them. And try and shoot down the line here. Uh, it is a real battle trying to get rid of these uh, these archers.
Oh my god. Oh my god, I fucking, I forgot to put them onto regular shot. That's makes a huge difference. No wonder we're having such trouble weeding them out here. God, we're almost out of ammo, ammunition. Alright, that unit's gone. Guys, shoot down the line there. So we've taken out two of their units, but uh, we have suffered some considerable damage in the process. What do we got here? Taking out their archer. I think this is gonna be a two say a two siege job. Um, because I think we're gonna run out of ammunition here. We've only taken out two of their archers. Alright, we're gonna unit down there. We uh, use up all our ammunition here. Alright, don't worry about that. You guys head to the uh, the edge of the map that on the move because I think we're going to have to do a two-part siege here and hope that we've got um, oh, enough enough juice left to finish them off here. But there, That's a third archer unit taken out. Move up. Down the line here. Let's see if we can see if we can reach them. Get in a better position to shoot them. Do need to wear them down a bit. Not gonna in the yeah we're we're definitely going to have to do another siege here another attack because we're running out of ammunition. Had we not suffered so many losses, we probably would have had, had enough in ammunition to get this done, get the, the job done here. But we just uh, suffered too many casualties. But we've almost with. This is the, the second to last of their archers, which means the next go around will they'll be almost defenseless uh, to our archer fire. We'll get some shots in on their general. Yeah, wearing him down. That's good. Just one more archer unit to deal with in the next in the next fight. Let's start uh, checking you guys out of here. We'll just use up the rest of our ammunition here. No, keep shooting. Keep shooting those bows. Those are the only thing that can really hurt us. Well, that in the towers, I guess. Uh, I was going to bring this guy up to block. Well, um, I wouldn't say it's a complete disaster, but it's definitely not not the result that we were looking for. Man, I really got to get my siege game my siege game going a little bit better. Um, if we're going to be able to take on England after this, because England is going to be much, much tougher fight. But yeah, like I said, I think we'll... We'll try and work towards replacing the tri the uh, the catapults with uh, with trebuchets. The men are running, cowards. Yeah, we're 
all running. We're gonna we're gonna play for the draw, and then uh, reattack them. They've only got one one archer unit left. Oh wait, 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 wait. These guys came back, and um, we won't have to take down these towers. We'll be able to take out those towers, which will give us a little bit more a little bit more range to work with. Uh, provided that we we don't lose any artillery pieces, which. I don't think we... Actually, I'm not sure if we will or not. Yeah, rough start over here when we got started, but um, the objective of taking out the archers almost complete. Just a couple more volleys, just let those volleys go through. And I think that's it. Alright, let's uh, speed it along. Where's the artillery? We'll take the artillery off first, I think. Holy sh... Shit. One, two, three, four, five units at least that we've got to get through. Could be more. Yeah, I don't know. I wonder what the stats are. We suffered a lot of damage there. I wonder if there. I wonder if there's any mercenaries here. I don't think there are. God, the artillery move just so fucking slow. So it was an, uh, an even bigger fast forward. One, two, three, four, five units. Yeah, it looks like five units. But yeah, they've only got one archer unit left. Which we saw how much damage that archer unit, that one archer unit, initially did. Come on. Well, I guess we can uh, we can drop the artillery and they'll move faster. But I wonder if that'll cause us to lose the artillery pieces. I mean, at this point, it's it's kind of a moot point. Because uh, if we, even if we lose the artillery, we're going to be replacing it, I think, with uh, with the trebuchets, or at least working towards that. Plus, this is our last siege for a little while, um, assuming that we win. Withdraw them first, and then we'll withdraw these guys. Tough nut to crack, for sure. Yeah, attacking in the snow is probably not the best idea. That little bit of attrition that we took might, um, might prove to be the difference. <laughs> They come down to our generals. We might need our generals to uh, get in there the men. The men broken and, are and uh, get the job done. Six hundred three. So they they took more losses than we did, which is good, but not by much. A little less than two hundred. But uh, one, two, three, four. Of their archers are down. They do have this guy and this guy. One, two, three, four, five, and then there's two. It should have been two reinforcing. Guys, as well. Spears. Okay. How did we lose this guy? 
How do we lose this guy? What the shit? He didn't even participate in the fighting. That's, uh... That's kind of fucked up. Yeah, there's no mercenary. There was a mercenary down here. We could have actually... Could have actually really used him. Just wondering if I should merge up our archers or just leave them as is. We'll be able to replace them later. I'm gonna merge these two. God, I wish we had some mercenaries available here. Would be nice. Receiving settlement. Oh shit! Right, we gotta we gotta back away and reattack it. I wonder how much attrition we suffered because of that. Ready for battle. We take this settlement. Um, really tempting to auto resolve it. Really tempting. But we'll fight it. Fight it out. Battle of Inverness. Those towers should be taken out, so we'll probably take out these two towers and then try and um, try and see if we can get a uh, a breach. Um, and these guys might be key. So we might might need this guy to come in and mop up after um oh look at this we've got dry conditions this time around all right it's the towers. I can't believe we lost that one one unit. And before I forget, God, I hate when I forget. I hate that the heavy shot is the default. I find the regular shot so much more effective. Got reinforced. Ah, oh, there's the reinforcements coming in there. All right, boys. Let's uh, get a move on. Ready for battle. Take these towers out. I'm. Just wondering if we should, well, I should probably be patient. I'm just a little bit, uh, I want to kind of rush this along because we're getting close to the hour mark for the, uh, for the video. But, um, I guess we can go a little bit, uh, a little bit longer. Shouldn't be too much of an issue. Should, you know, siege is all about, uh, sieging is all about patience. And I haven't been, I haven't been the most patient during these, some of these sieges.
Yeah, first thing we need to take out are these and those. Beauty. The enemy's tower has been destroyed. We got this tower now as well. Alright, let's move you in over here. Bring the archers in behind. Move slowly. And we'll probably probably hit the gatehouse uh, to create our uh, breach. Got a unit, unit inside their spears. One, two, three, four, five. I think there's like seven units left for us. Fuck, they hit another one of the, uh, one of the onagers for 8%. Ooh, yeah, we really gotta, uh, really gotta rethink our, our army when we take on England. I think, I think the best way to go is numbers. Go cheap spear, like it gives much cheap spear and cheap archers as possibly can, and then support them with um, with some cavalry, some elite cavalry if you can afford it. And then of course, um, it's not the best shooting them on the walls there. I want you guys to uh, focus on focus on those. Take you guys off fire at will because we want to be a little bit judicious here with our uh, our ammunition. guys hold your fire for now. The tower just does not want to go down. And you guys shoot at them now. There we go, get the towers down. Alright, beauty. Beauty, beauty. Probably shouldn't need these guys to block. We, get, we should be able to if once once we get rid of um, these skirmishers here, we can kind of get in behind and um, get the archers from there. Yeah, that's it. Just break already. Shit, they're moving their archers. Not what I wanted them to do. Okay, they moved them back. That's good. Just don't want to completely break. There we go. Good, 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 good. All right, hold your fire, hold your fire. All right, let's bring you guys up. Archers are on the move. Where are they moving to? I think they're moving into the spot. Oh, maybe not. Maybe they're just going to stand there. Gotta shoot at them as well. Take them out quickly, and then um, and then we'll be able to manage this pretty easily. Just about... Yeah, once, once their range is taken out, it's just a matter of shooting fish in a barrel. Oh shit, I wanted you guys to... Uh, Break the gatehouse. 
shit. Why are you standing there? You're supposed to be. Damn it, we're taking damage. Our archers. Almost. Though, though we gotta be careful these um, these swords have javelins as well. So there is that. Those archers are just about worn out. Alright, beautiful. And see if it gets... Let's get into formation. We just pull up a little bit. Well, yeah. We just don't want to break completely. 23 of them left. There we go, that should hopefully finish them off. A nice volley right there. Alright, yeah, I think we've got this. There's a unit sitting over there. At least one. There's one, uh... Alright, beauty. Take out the general. Let's take out the general as well. Actually, you two focus on those swords there. Alright. Pretty confident that we got this now. Where's, um, let's bring up, a little bit dangerous bringing these guys in, the generals, but enemy general is dead, good. But I'm hoping, uh, just with the numbers, they'll be somewhat protected. Uh, but we'll bring, in, we'll bring in the archers as well. Bring these guys in to, uh, cover for, or to protect them. Oh, there's that unit of, of uh, that unit of, of axes. Can't see them, unfortunately. Guys, oh, there they are. Under attack by what? Yeah, there's one spare unit back here in the uh, in the center. Let's get rid of these guys first. You guys, uh, hold your fire. These guys will do a better job. A little bit close here for friendly fire potentially, but. Yeah, just one more unit in the center, and I think we're done. Came in a little bit over the hour mark, but it shouldn't be too bad. We should be should be finished here in the next couple minutes. But it was definitely worth it. Victory at last. Alright. Um, you guys come in. Uh, not you. And... You guys come in and head for the uh, head for this. Maybe we can trigger the uh, the army losses. Actually, one of you come over here and capture this. Can't remember if cavalry has. Oh, there we go. Army losses. Beauty. Ooh, and thus ends. Northern Ireland. We only lost 13 that time around, so 
what a difference it is when you can eliminate their uh, their ranged units. So it would have been a much tougher siege with um, with that army sitting in there. That's for sure. We're lucky that we were able to uh, draw them into that ambush. Ooh, subjugate. Let's occupy. Alright, so our income is a little bit... It's not too bad right now. I might... Um, probably should hold on to them for now. Um, but yeah, we'll have to figure out what we're going to have. We're going to reorganize. And make our preparations to, uh, to take on England. Um, so it'll take probably... It'll probably take a little while. Before uh, Imperial Succession Communist Bologna Kings. Yeah, it'll probably take a little while before we're ready to fight the English, but see if we can get our income up a little bit and build the biggest army possible. Just go with cheap spears. Um lots of uh lots of archers and um and cav where we can fill in the cav. But uh thank you very much for watching guys. Part number seven will be next. Have yourselves a uh, wonderful day. Ragnarok uh, signing out.